Proverbs chapter 27 provides us with a bunch more wisdom. Things like, don't be presumptuous, be open to discipline from the wise, and invest in your marriage, just to name a few. But one passage from today's reading really stood out to me. Proverbs 27, 19 says this, As water reflects the face, so one's life reflects the heart. Wow, pretty powerful statement for sure. See, when, when you look into water, you see what is really there. You see an exact representation of what you look like. There, there's no hiding from it, right? There's no pretending that it's different than what it is. What you are is what you are seeing. In the same way, if you want to know what's in your heart, look at your life. If you want to know what your priorities really are, look at your checkbook. If you want to know what really matters to you, look at your daily calendar. If you want to know how much your Bible means to you, look at the margins and the corners of the pages. Are there notes written in there? Are the corners worn from all the turning that you've done? See. I think we often believe things about ourselves that just simply aren't true. We want them to be true. We wish they were true, but they just aren't. Can I encourage you today to, to look at your life, your actual life. Take an inventory of your time, your talents, and your treasures and see if how you use these things line up with what you believe to be true about your heart. The reality is this. We can't deny our reflection. It merely shows us what we really look like. And in the same way, an examination of our life will not lie either. So take this examination, evaluate your life, and if you come to the conclusion that you don't like what this examination tells you, pray that the Lord will fill you with wisdom to make the necessary changes. Let's pray. Oh God, would you seek our heart and reveal any ways that are in error within us? God, would you give us a true vision of who we really are, the things that we love, the things that we value, the priorities that are in our life. And God, where these things reveal to us we are off, would you just gently bring us back? Lord, would you help us to align the actual things in our life with what we hope is true deep in our heart? God, we want to be people whose lives are congruent with what we say we really believe. So God, make that true in us today. God, we love you and we want to be all about you. We want to live for you and we want to be a people whose hearts are fully devoted to you and whose lives echo that, mirror that, and display that moment by moment. God, we love you and we praise you in Jesus' name. Would you dig in today to Proverbs chapter 27?